What we're going to take a look at today is the Datalight solution and the performance of our file system, Reliance Nitro, and EMMC driver, FlashVexE. Comparing that to the basic Linux solution, which is the EXT4 and the basic EMMC driver. So this test we're running here is the AndroBench test. Both units are running on a Panda board. We've used a Micron EMMC part hooked up through this SD adapter. Let me go ahead and run this. This is performing 300 of each transaction. These are SQLite inserts, followed by updates, followed by deletes. And what we're doing is measuring the performance speed of the Datalite solution, FlashVexE and Reliance Nitro, versus ext 4 and the basic Linux driver, the Android default. The Datalite system is done in just over 10 seconds, whereas the basic system is still working on the first step. The resulting values are given in a number of transactions per second. Here we're using the same media, the same operating system, and the same processor. The only difference is the data management software. We chose AndroBench because it measures SQLite performance at the application level, reflective of what the user will experience. SQLite is a database engine which is used by default for applications on Android. The basic Android is finally finished at nearly 60 seconds. So here are the results of the test. As we have seen, Datalite is much faster than the basic Linux solution for this range of different functions. Datalite software is particularly effective in fighting write amplification. What is not shown here, but has been measured in our labs using erase counts, is that Datalite software writes the same data with less than a third of the overhead, increasing the endurance of the flash memory also does this using less than one-sixth of the power, which extends the working time of battery-powered devices. If you'd like to evaluate Datalite FlashVexE and Reliance Nitro for your project, visit our website and click Try Download Buy, or send an email to info at datalite.com.